babes and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Remix, uh, where we are currently on Mitten University Remix. In the last episode, we worked very much on um, uh, trying to get the foundations of the hospital uh, okay, you know, so that we're earning a little bit of money. We've got s some things happening here. And we've done that quite well. Um, we've sent this person home because they need a psychiatrist. And at the moment, we don't have one, but I have employed a doctor here isabel um i'm thinking that she might be perfect for the role so um we can finally get to training some staff and we are going to uh train her, uh, with herman here um because of course in mitten all the the doctors and nurses are our students um so we're not going to be able to employ somebody to get them trained up on the cheap we're gonna have to do it this way oh look now, that's a clinic patient, so we are going to send them away. I'm not interested in building clinics, even though they are enjoying that thing. Now, we can also improve uh, this training room. Um, I'm going to remove a bunch of chairs. It's very rare to be wanting to train that sort of many people up um, in one go. Let's have a look at the items here. So this is the one we want. So let's get rid of these. Move these. There we go. Now, I'm not going to be able to afford too many of these at the moment. But we can get, we can certainly get some more in there for a bit of an upgrade. Um, now, we're also going to want to make this just a little bit warmer in here. Great. Good. There we go. So it's a little bit warmer. Uh, now, something. There's a few things that I like to put in the training room. So this uh, can boost training. It all stacks, of course. Uh, this boosts training. There we go. Uh, lovely. And there's some pictures as well. Let's get our pictures that we like to put in. We'll, we'll put them across here. Uh, where are they? There they are. Um, we will pop you in. Of all this space, we're going to do it a bit differently from what we would normally do. Yeah. Um, I also quite like, not that it adds any benefit to the room, but I just like to pick that up. Okay, good. <laughs> there we are. Good, so we've got a bit of training going. What is this? A grey anatomy emergency. Yeah, yeah. Um, so psychiatry required, um, get them to wait. We're almost there. Diagnostic decision, um, send them for treatment. I don't know what they had. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but they are almost trained. Look, they are almost trained. A new illness has been discovered. Mucky feet. Oh no. So the problem with mucky feet is if we, uh, turn hygiene on here. Uh, oh, actually. Oh, maybe they used. No, they can't use a hand sanitizer. There's no. The thing about mucky feet is they tend to spread dirt around the hospital quite quickly. But it all looks pretty clean. It's pretty good, eh? Uh, what we'll do is, though, just pop that there. Yeah. Okay. It looks like we're sort of getting away with that. That's great. That's great. Um, we need to generate some research points, so getting um, the research centre open would be great. Uh, that would be pretty great. Also, we need to start looking at this superbug. So, um, yeah, let's see. We need to get a janitor and train them. Oh, look. You're actually pretty great. We are going, uh, yeah, to get you in. Um, now, you... We're actually going to change these guys over and Cat here is going to become our mechanic. So we are going to spend some money on getting them trained. Yeah. Uh, oh, we need psych. We actually need the psychiatry office, don't we? <laughs> totally forgot about that. Let's get that done. So here we'll do. Uh, yeah. Excellent. Um, let's see, do you know what, I might pop it there. Now, this is going to be treatment only, so I'm going to only use the treatment bookcases here. There we go. Yeah. Excellent. Um, 
thing is, is I do kind of like them to come straight in and sit uh, down instantly. Where's that rug? There it is. Um, yeah. I might put it a bit further away from the fireplace. Um, so that they can walk in through the door. And pretty much sit straight down. Uh, yeah. I think we are going to move it a little bit closer. There we go. Um, and then get our psychiatrist's chair uh, in. Do you know what? I might just stick them back here like this with their lamp. Very, very posh. There we go. There we go. Um, now, we will cover up all the stuff behind here because what's behind here? The drugs, of course. Uh, let's put the window in, get the drugs in. Oh, 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 no, you will go. There we go. <laughs> Excellent. Um, now, the psychiatrist is going to need something to drink, something to eat. Excellent. They also need their certificate. Very important piece of equipment. Uh, there it is. <laughs> Good. Um, now, we need something lovely above the fireplace. Um, ship in the bottle or the singing fish. Um, both look good, um, but I suppose maybe we want the singing fish. We enjoy the singing fish. Um, now, something that should probably be in every psychiatrist's room. This here, look. There we go. Stick that in there. Um, oh, ooh. the thing we used to put above the fireplace, of course, was the clock, because it's very important that the uh, psychiatrist knows how long their session has been. Uh, we could stick it. Do you know what? We will pop it by the door. Yeah. Excellent. There we go. I think that's where we'll leave that room for the moment. Um, although, what I would say is that the heat probably isn't enough from this radiator. Um, so we will stick in a heater just to make it nice and toasty. And actually, if we look at it, this room is so close to level four, it's actually painful. Um, so maybe we should put something nice in there. Um, okay, do you know, maybe something from this set would be nice. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe they talk about dreams, probably. So, we'll stick that in there. What, why? It's invalid for the room. We can't put these in rooms. This is, makes me sad. It makes me sad. Okay, so what can we put in here that would just improve things a smidge just a smidge something i want in here obviously uh, oh that's that'll do it <laughs> okay good right nice and then what we're going to do is set this to treatment only excellent that's that sorted wow do you know what actually i'm going to move this over to here Wow, it's getting really pokey. This is annoying. Um, don't you think? I think it's annoying. Oh, we could stick it. Oh, we could stick it in there. Stick it in there. Get it. Get it out of the way. You know. Get it out of the way. That'll do it. Right. Um, now we'll move these. Oops. We'll move these ones. But we should probably put some more over here shouldn't we so let's get some more cheesy gubbins and burp over here as well there we go oh my god i love this thing what we might do just so they're not in everyone's way as much let's just do that excellent okay all right so when they are trained we can upgrade um the drug mixer which will means we'll complete this and then we can have a look at um at the new global super bug pretty pleased about that excited like for it um we could probably uh, I don't know. I don't know. maybe we'll just stick a couple of bins here for now look they're using it they're using it maybe we should create like a little meeting space we can have a chat sit down have a chat 
put a little table in between. <laughs> Actually, can we do that? Can we, can we can we have a little table outside? Probably not. Probably not. No, we could have could have a snail. It would invoke conversation, I would have thought. Uh, there doesn't seem to be. Oh, I I also quite like the, the cubes of sitting. So you know, it's a meeting. Good meeting, everyone. Good meeting. Good meeting, everyone. That's. <laughs> Ah, they're amazing. Maybe we can talk about the butterfly. Today we're reviewing this butterfly. Oh, right. Okay, <laughs> it's that time of year. Open them. Great. Haven't we done well? Uh, good. <laughs> uh, reporter. Yes, please do come along. Misery guts. Pharmacy. Great. Excellent. Uh, Q's getting pretty big. Q is getting pretty big. The old GP there, isn't it? Pretty big. Um, maybe we should see about getting another one in. Another one. They all have weak bladders. Okay. Uh, why? We'll get you in. You can be a GP. And you know what? Chloe Eggnog can also be a GP. There we go. And uh, we will copy this. And just stick it there. There we go. There it is. Actually, no. I want I want people to use this. So... <laughs> took all that time to build it. I wanted to use it. Um, chromotherapy. Send the patient home. Although, to be honest, we might have to build chromotherapy. Oh, all right, all right. I'd like some other illnesses to come up that don't require a clinic if possible so with our second member of staff trained um let's get that upgraded what is this diagnostic decision um send for treatment no okay good and that'll uh, deal with this and then we can see about helping out on the uh, global superbug nodes uh, maybe just uh, one though because um, I have got peeps to help out but look here I mean we could do some here maybe this ghost one would be good um, but yeah we really need somebody to come along and just finish this who could that possibly be um, I wonder I don't know these um, it's a shame who, who could we get to help don't know and then we've got similar limitations here with Miss Nitwit um, and uh, Gring has a similar issue with learning machine learning um, we don't have any more learning machine learnings coming in uh, I'm wondering if we should try and get them to help each other so I think yeah, they need... Look. Well, mind you, Miss Nitwit's not done this herself yet. But we could do... She did that one. Um, we could do with getting... Maybe we could get Gring in here. Maybe we could help Nitwit invite Gring. And, um, and that, that might help push things along a little bit. It's a, <laughs> it's a bit of a thing. I'm stuck. I can't pick up any more until until it's it's cleared. Um, but it is, it is a little bit stuck. Right. Um, okay, okay, okay. Where are we with things? Um, we would like to train more staff. Um, I'd like to train a GP up. Um, I think that'd be pretty, that could be pretty great. Um, because we have three GPs and that would, that would cover us. If we, if we, are you a spare GP? Oh no, you're the psychiatrist. Uh, you? Are you the GP? You are. You're a spare GP. So if we trained you in general practice and we got Huggles in just to train you, Tig, and then Tig can one by one train the others, I think that would probably be all right. Let's send you away. God, you look a lot like Jasmine Odyssey. 
a lot like Jasmine Odyssey. Five five. <laughs> she's uh, she's in disguise. Right, you as well. Oh, I don't. Dave Chunder. <laughs> oh, and you. No. No, Petra. No. Good. There we go. Right, can you take this seriously? Stop that, Tig, and sit down. That's it. Teacher's in the house. Pay attention. Eh? Not paying all that money for you to lark about. Uh, how's it going? We could put something in the middle here. Uh, just to make this a little more interesting. <laughs> there it is. Good. I'm pleased. Well. Ooh, look, this upgrade has almost happened. Ugh. We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on, on our floor. floor. Okay. Maybe I should start a learning machine learning and invite those three to it. Maybe that's, maybe that's what I could do. Excellent. So I completed something. The green look. Maybe that's what I'll do. But for now, let's have a look at the new superbug. A brand new superbug. Um, I reckon we should be able to catch it, capture some ghosts. I'm pretty confident we're going to be killing some people. Um, and that from that, ghosts will spawn. Uh, what is going on here? She's on break. Shall we see about getting... Upping the... Uh... uh Right. Get out of there. Will... He won't fit there. Sad times. Will... Squawky. Yes! <laughs> Excellent. Uh, good. So, if we... Oh! Look at Zoe! Oh my goodness! Hired? Hired or what? Um, ooh, and isn't there, like, this new mat now? Mm, mat? Yeah, look. It's nice. <laughs> there we go. Uh, I wish probably... Oops, that's not the thing I wanted to... Okay. It's too small. It can't seem to find it. If we uh, put it also... There we go. Nice. Good news, Mint University has awarded us... Uh, 10,000 doubloons for the completion of some training. Excellent. So what we can now do is get Chloe Eggnog in for some GP training with Tig. So we all mean we're down to one GP again, uh, which means we'll close this office for a bit um, because it's going to be a little while before... We have, uh, we're back up with uh, the GPs because afterwards, of course, we're going to train Coop here. Um, what is this? A scent for treatment. What is this? Go 90 days without a death. Sure, <laughs> we're never going to do that. Uh, oh, look. A Sally Fig Blanket's latest county roundup just went live. Maybe it was a slow news day, but we get a nice, big positive mention. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Excellent. I'm so pleased. That's it, you sweep it. You sweep that up. Right, let's wait for this GP training uh, to be done. Oh, she hasn't even arrived yet. Ooh, we need... Uh, there's somebody here who needs the injection room. Now, that's a room I'm willing to build. Um, because what's great about the injection room, of course, is that it will uh, treat uh, many different illnesses. Therefore, it's much better uh, financially for the hospital than... Um, uh, a clinic. That's it. That's 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 the word I'm looking for. Right. So let's stick. Do you know what? We'll stick that there. That'll be good. And we're going to need a fire extinguisher here because this machine can catch fire. Uh, let's also put in a nice hot radiator. Um, we need in here uh, all the bits for the member of staff. So by the radiator, let's pop down a nice comfy chair at a slight jaunt. Uh, also a good spot for their certificate. 
and um, we're going to need a hand sanitizer to keep them uh, clean and fresh uh, but also we need to keep them well watered and fed so ah, typical so let's get those bits in we'll pop them there do you know what we might see it has no bearing to the room at all um, but I like it it's a bit of clutter for the room there we go excellent so what we need is a nurse to work it um, Denise is unhygienic so I'm thinking probably not <gasps> Tilly now Tilly's the name of my cat so I'm going to hire Tilly here um, let's see treatment and I want you to work only in the injection room there we go oh yeah oh yeah okay back back to uh, the GP training then I guess with one GP trained oh, we went 90 days without a death can you believe it um, we need another GP bit of training um, let's see speed oh actually eggnog here can uh, train a little bit faster uh, so we'll, we'll go with that and we just need to try and help the GP out where possible but the queue it is it is piling up there is no doubt it is absolutely piling up um, let's see about sending you away I've also noticed we're starting to get some um, uh, DNA patients in um, now they're going to be great um, so I think what we should do is consider getting a doctor at uh, trained up high energy um, for uh, the DNA machine because that's 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 a, such a good money maker right there such a good money maker so we're seeing some staff unhappy with uh, their wages so let's satisfy those um, let's uh, oh uh, yeah let's upgrade yeah this yeah we'll do that we'll upgrade that uh, let's send him for treatment see if we keep this queue down while we're a bit shot sh shot a bit short uh, on the GPS uh, yes. um, keen keen to get this uh, plot open I think um, it's starting to get a little bit low on space so trying to get some treatments out to here would be nice um, I think be pretty nice um, or maybe we could move training out yeah might move training out um, so that we can get a DNA in here that would that would be pretty good and maybe we could also build uh, research over here so that we could get researching these points so we can get this other one open Ooh, yeah uh, I think uh, I've always got this sort of um, the flow in mind of the hospital and this always what worked nicely with this one is actually having GP and then going through diagnostics and then into to um, treatment up here because they can all, always take shortcuts it's like a really nice setup here at Mitten and then I had all this as training and research um, and I'll probably end up doing something fairly similar to that uh, as as the hospital grows we need to help you out let's put you to the top you're looking a bit peaky at uh, 64% a little bit low but we're getting a little bit desperate at the same time uh, yeah look their happiness is down how are we doing over here we're getting there do you know what we might do is open this up that's what we might do um, so that the queues can start to split um, they can start to form here and then they can deal with it because tick here probably needs a break no no ticks good ticks good that's great doctor is on their way to the GP office momentarily Give him a minute. There we go. Please become a ghost. Please become a ghost. That'd be great. Jazz hands. Love jazz hands. Um, ward. Fantastic. Fantastic. Another illness that we can cover with the rooms and staff. We already have. Oh Woohoo! Oh, it's this one. Oh, well, that's perfect. Because actually this is the side that I kind of want all that on. What we're going to do is build a new training room over here. 
we are going to build a new training room um and then delete the other one so training because again i like to do my little nook um very important to me there we go um now good nice nice and what we can do actually is uh i mean even though you earn the same amount from selling them and buying them back i'm still going to move them over just to pretend that we're recycling <laughs> <laughs> and then what we'll do oops put that one down badly what we'll do i'll oh, just get him in there just get him in there i'll sort them out in a minute um okay what we can do it's a shame that there's actually a window behind that bookcase isn't there it's, it's a little bit annoying uh let's why won't you go back there why why are you doing this why why are you like this? What? Is that one not? Oh, it's it's the one next to it. It's actually not in there properly. Okay. Good. What? What? Why? Oh, what's happening here? This has always fit before. Why it fit? Why it not fit now? It does. Oh, it's so weird. That was very weird. That was very weird. I don't know what is happening um okay anyway let's carry on with it uh so to heat the room this might be a bit overkill no no it's good actually it's good um actually i think oh i think we will actually put because they always complain about being chilly uh, the trainer that comes in they always do unless i do two small ones god that's going back though um it's it's in there in the depths of my memory um so we're gonna pop him there and we'll pop this one here this is where i like to put the whiteboard um because it doesn't matter that the door's in the way there it goes and then we can put all the training posters along here here they are there we go nice now, with our new training room, we can now sell this one. Boom. And we can see about um, getting the... Let's do some training. Uh, actually, what is that? The only doctor I haven't trained it is, actually. Let's get Ginny in, then, to do genetics. Lovely. And let's build because it's an expensive room and we're going to use most of our money here our dna lab there it is okay uh you need the full size do you okay that's fine we can do that uh let's stick the door Ooh, there um we want the feet near the door so the patient can just sort of walk in and do what they need to do we also need a fire extinguisher very important um and we'll try and get the radiator more central in this room actually though under the window would be good and the patient's not in there long whereas the staff members in there a lot um with that in mind let's get a nice comfy chair in with their certificate of approval there we go. so we know that they're trained and then uh, food and drink as always um, hot chocolate makes them happy some food um, oh and a hand sanitizer nice there it is now we're going to want to set this to treatment only um, how's the training coming along we might uh, we might actually just leave it open as well you know we might just leave it open um, let's get a couple of bennies in here and a couple of notice boards as well. Excellent. So it's uh, pretty kitted out, ready for our genetics doctor. You can go home. Um, where is our psychiatrist? Maybe they're on a, a break. They are, actually. 
They're pretty knackered. They needed a break. That's absolutely fine. Maybe we should consider getting another another psychiatrist, perhaps. Uh, we got. We need to get rid of all the clinic patients. Not interested in seeing clinics, a clinical patients at all. Um, oh, see, look. Now, I would imagine it's going to be extremely difficult to diagnose Rory here. Extremely difficult. Um, so that's the next thing. We've got we've got the piece of machinery to treat him but to diagnose him is going to be extremely difficult um yeah so what we need to do is get some more diagnostic rooms going uh fluid analysis i think is good for is it blood pudding he has i, I can't remember uh we've got general let's put in so far away though isn't it do you know what we'll do we'll edit this room sorry they're in the middle of see seeing somebody there i'm gonna move this room over to here um we're going to move the toilets over to there yeah and we are going to move dna round to here even though i've just built its spinners this is this is thing all oh, mono browing this is the thing isn't it is that this starts to happen a lot let's uh, give them the bin and then put out move move our bennies uh no notice boards it's very temporary right reason being is i want to keep the nurses diagnostic rooms together um because we get the same group of nurses out uh, walking around them and this should give us enough space uh, to do uh both fluid analysis uh, and the other one. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you to all my Patreons for their continued support.